we tested some of the most popular water filters that are certified for microplastics reduction and ranked them using our data-driven scoring system to find out which ones are actually worth your money. In this video, I'll share our top picks for microplastics removal and explain why official performance certifications matter more than ever. Now, normally, as you know, I lab test every filter myself, but in this case, I haven't been able to directly test for microplastics just yet. The main challenge is that I haven't found a real world water source with verified microplastics contamination to use for testing. I've considered spiking a sample with microplastics, but that's a big departure from the usual way I test water filters under real world conditions with only the contaminants already present in the tap water. That said, I do plan to test various products for microplastics reduction in the future, once I can nail down a practical approach that gives meaningful data. But in the meantime, I wanted to get this video out using the best source of evidence, which is actually even better than my at-home testing, official certifications to NSF ANSI standard 401, which confirm a filter's ability to reduce microplastics. This certification involves rigorous third-party testing to confirm a filter's ability to remove at least 85% of plastic particles as small as 0.5 microns. So for this video, I only included filters that hold this certification and performed well in our own lab testing for other contaminants. If you're serious about reducing microplastics in your drinking water, this is the best place to start. So let me explain exactly how we evaluated each filter. We scored each one across six key criteria, with contaminant reduction carrying the most weight. Using Simple Lab's TAP score test kits, we tested before and after samples to evaluate how well each filter removed harmful contaminants already present in our tap water. And while the advanced city water test kits we used for this did not include analysis for microplastics, combining this lab data with certified performance to NSF ANSI 401 gives us a much clearer picture of how these systems perform overall. Beyond contaminant removal, we also assessed build quality, filtration rate, ease of use, ongoing cost, and company policies like warranties and return windows. Starting off at the top of the list with the highest scoring filter overall is the AquaTrue Carafe, a countertop reverse osmosis system that combines exceptional performance with the all-important microplastic certification. This system is officially certified by IATMO to NSF ANSI standard 401, verifying its ability to reduce microplastics as small as 0.5 microns by at least 85% under rigorous standardized conditions in the lab. In our testing using TAP score water analysis kits, the carafe achieved a 100% reduction of various contaminants with health effects in our water, including things like fluoride, nitrate, uranium, and chloroform. No other countertop RO system we've tested has matched that level of performance. In addition to NSF 401, the AquaTrue Carafe also holds certifications to NSF ANSI 42, 53, and 58, meaning it's been independently validated to reduce a whopping 83 contaminants the manufacturer claims it can address. No other water filter we've tested so far is this extensively certified. It also holds an NSF ANSI 372 certification for material safety, so the components in contact with your water are certified lead free. Design-wise, the unit is compact and attractive with a glass collection carafe. It's a plug and play countertop system, so that means no plumbing or tools required, making it ideal for renters or anyone who wants a high performance system without the hassle of an under sink install. Maintenance is straightforward and reasonably priced, though you will need to manually empty and refill the tap water tank regularly. Its efficiency is another big benefit. It wastes just one gallon for every four gallons of purified water, one of the best efficiency ratios we've seen across all of the RO systems we've tested. Now, its filtration speed is one of its slight setbacks. We measured a flow rate of about 0.03 gallons per minute, or eight cups in just under 17 minutes. But for most households, that's a fair trade-off for the level of performance and certification that this system provides. The one-year warranty feels a little short given the upfront price, but the 30-day return policy and free shipping help to balance that out. If you're looking for a microplastic certified lab tested reverse osmosis system with strong contaminant removal overall, the AquaTrue Carafe is easily one of the best options available. 
Now, if you like the sound of the carafe, but want something with a bit more capacity and convenience, AquaTrue also makes a larger version that might be a better fit. Just like the carafe, the Classic is officially certified by IATMO to NSFANCY 401 to reduce microplastic particles as small as half a micron. That makes it one of the few consumer grade countertop filters on the market with certified microplastics reduction capabilities. And because it uses the exact same filter technology, its performance in our own lab testing was also just as good as the carafe eliminating the concerning contaminants detected in our water, including fluoride, uranium, lead, nitrate, and chlorine. So why are we listing it separately? Because while the performance is essentially the same, the size and usability are different enough that it might suit other users better. Instead of a glass carafe, the classic model collects filtered water in a Triton plastic tank with a built-in dispenser. It also offers a larger purified water holding capacity and longer lasting filters, which translates to slightly lower ongoing maintenance costs, about eight cents cheaper per gallon compared to the carafe. Its filtration speed is also a touch faster, coming in at 0.04 gallons per minute, purifying 11 cups of water in 15 minutes, 53 seconds. On the flip side, the plastic construction does bring down the design score slightly, especially if you're trying to avoid plastic altogether. Together. But from a technical standpoint, it still hits all the right marks, certified to NSF 401 for microplastics, NSF 42, 53, and 58 for contaminant reduction, and NSF 372 for lead-free materials. Setup is just as easy, no tools or plumbing, and it's backed by the same one-year warranty, 30-day return policy, and free shipping. So if you like what the AquaTrue Carafe has to offer, but need a slightly larger, higher capacity countertop system with the same certified performance and slightly lower ongoing costs, then the AquaTrue Classic is a strong alternative. Now, if you wanna get rid of microplastics without electricity or generating wastewater, our next pick takes a completely different approach. Coming in third on our list is the British Birkfeld, fitted with its ultra sterosil ceramic filters. This is the only large volume gravity fed system on our list that's certified for microplastics reduction, meeting NSFANCY standard 401 for performance. British Birkfeld offers two filter types, the ultra sterosil and the ultra fluoride. While we've tested both, the ultra sterosil is the only one that's currently certified for microplastics, so that's what we'll focus on for this video. In our lab testing, the ultra sterosil filters delivered strong results, removing 100% of uranium, chlorine, copper, and molybdenum, and 70% of nitrate. It didn't reduce fluoride, but this was expected since they sell separate filters specifically for that. The system itself is built from 304 stainless steel, so your water avoids plastic contact post-filtration. That's a big plus if you're trying to limit plastic recontamination, which is often overlooked in microplastics discussions. It's also certified to NSF 372 for material safety and lead-free construction. Setup and maintenance are refreshingly simple, especially compared to other stainless steel gravity filters. That's because the ultra sterosil filters don't require a tedious priming process. You just fill the upper chamber and let water naturally saturate the filters over time. It's a much more straightforward experience than the manual priming many gravity filters require, which often involves awkward priming buttons under the faucet. Now, speed is not this unit's strength. We measured a filtration rate of just 0.27 gallons per hour, taking seven and a half hours to filter 2.02 gallons. That's slow even for a gravity filter, so you'll need to plan ahead and maybe let the unit filter overnight. But the trade-off is a low maintenance, minimal waste, and non-electric system backed by excellent company policies, including a lifetime warranty, free shipping on orders over $99, and a 30-day satisfaction guarantee. If you're looking for a certified, non reverse osmosis alternative that filters microplastics, the British Bergfeld is absolutely worth considering. And finally, if you're looking for the simplest and most affordable way to filter microplastics, this last option might surprise you. Rounding out the list is the Brita Elite Pitcher Filter, a bit of an outlier in this roundup, and here's why. In terms of 
overall contaminant removal, it's what we'd call middle of the road. It didn't score high enough to make our shortlist of the best water filter pitchers overall. But here's the key reason why it made this list. It's the only water filter pitcher that we've tested that holds an official microplastics reduction certification. That alone makes it worth considering if you're specifically looking for a low cost, no fuss way to reduce microplastics in your drinking water. The Elite Filter is WQA certified to NSF ANSI standard 401, which verifies its ability to remove microplastic particles down to 0.5 microns. It's an upgraded version of Brita's standard filter designed to remove more contaminants and last longer, up to six months per cartridge, according to Brita. In our lab testing, the Elite removed 100% of chlorine, phosphorus, and barium, and reduced copper by 97%. However, it struggled with some of the other contaminants found in our treated groundwater, including fluoride, uranium, nitrate, molybdenum, strontium, and sulfate. Now, that doesn't mean that the filter is ineffective, just that it's better suited to other water situations with different contaminants present. That's why I always recommend testing your water first so you can match the filter to your specific water quality. Now, a quick word about materials. The Brita pitcher is made from polypropylene and SAN plastic, which may be a concern if you're trying to avoid any chance of plastic recontamination. While we haven't seen specific leaching test data for this model, research suggests that polypropylene leaches more under certain conditions, like exposure to UV light, or stagnant water with biofilm. You can help minimize that risk by keeping the pitcher out of direct sunlight, replacing filters on schedule, and immediately transferring your filtered water into a glass or stainless steel container if you're still concerned. Back to the positives, this is by far the fastest and easiest filter to set up on this list. There's no plumbing, no tools, and very minimal filter flushing required. And with a filtration speed of 2.92 gallons per hour, it's about 10 times faster than the British Bergfeld. It also has one of the lowest ongoing costs of any pitcher we've tested, just 17 cents per gallon. And Brita backs the product with a one year warranty and 30 day money back guarantee. So if you're looking for a budget friendly, certified solution for microplastics reduction and want to get started with the smallest investment of time and money, the Brita Elite is a solid choice. When it comes to filters that are truly certified to reduce microplastics, these four stood out in our testing, not just for their certifications, but for their overall performance and usability. That said, there's still room for more competition in this space. Certified microplastics reduction is a high bar and not many products currently achieve it. The AquaTrue Carafe and Classic are great choices if you want comprehensive RO purification without the hassle of an undersink installation. The British Birkfeld offers a non-electric, large capacity stainless steel gravity system with zero wastewater, and for a budget-friendly entry-level solution, the Brita Elite remains the only certified pitcher filter we can recommend for microplastics. All four options are independently certified to NSF ANSI 401, which means they've been verified to remove plastic particles as small as 0.5 microns. Now, if you're not sure which filter is right for your home, Home, stick around and watch one of the dedicated reviews of these filters where I go into the data in more detail. Click or tap to keep watching.